What if I can tell you that you can save your time and efforts whenever you are doing a software testing for a particular product? It can be a web application or mobile application. In this video, I'm going to talk about a big time testing technique which can definitely help you to reduce your time and efforts. All right. So let's jump into it and see what exactly it is. What are the drawbacks? What are advantages of big bang testing? All right. So let's get started. Hey guys, welcome to Testing Academy. My name is Pramod and we are discussing the Big Bang testing today. Okay, so let's jump into it and let's see what exactly is a Big Bang testing. First of all, uh, to understand Big Bang, you have to understand integration testing. And when we do inter integration testing, this is the levels of testing. First of all, disclaimer guys, this, these screenshots are I have found on Google. So uh, references are on the description. So don't uh, curse me on that. Okay. All right. So we have generally uh, whenever developer develops something, they do unit testing. After that, they do integration testing. When we have a system combined, we do system testing and we have acceptance testing after that so that people can accept the application that is developed. Right. So Big Bang testing is basically a part of a, it. Call it Big Bang approach, which is a part of integration testing. And it basically means uh, it's an integration testing strategy wherein all the units are linked together and resulting them into complete system. Let me give you a very practical example. What exactly is a big bang? Suppose you have a login module, checkout module and a payment module for a e-commerce web application. Now, uh, probably you have tested only the login part. So it, it's a module A. If you have tested checkout as a separate entity, it's a module B. For example, you have tested payment, only payment related third party payment, it is module C. Now what you are doing is that you are integrating all of them since we are doing integration testing, right? So we are integrating them and now we have a complicated system, right? And that's what we are testing. It's known as big bank approach. That's what we are doing. So if you see this example, we have to, we have module A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. We are testing it with the like combined system. So that's what it's a big bang. Right, we are creating a bank now because now right now we have a whole system ready and how it is helpful first of all let's discuss about the drawbacks what are the problem here whenever we have a big system right we have a login page checkout processing and everything is now a complicated system so what will happen is that it's very hard to find where is the bug we have found the bug but uh, where is the bug right what exactly is the root cause that is very important and programmatic for large application it, if you have a very very large application where you have 150 plus modules suppose now it's very difficult to find bug and uh, means finding bug is not difficult i mean to say that a root cause finding where it is in the which module it's very difficult debugging and all risk in losing some of sometimes or uh, risk of uh, losing the bugs sometimes due to the uh since we have combined all the units now right so it can risk sometimes leaking up advantages of course it saves times and efforts, which is I always recommend uh, if you have a particular web application, combine it in a complicated system and check the end to end flows. Testing the whole application, which is very beneficial, little planning, you don't have to plan, you just have to check out the uh, login plus checkout plus processing because you are ma majorly concerned about the application is working fine. Focus on the testing of the full app and finding the bug. So that's what is an advantage, right? I hope you have learned something new and you have got the idea what exactly is a big book testing. It is very important for an interview purpose. And sometimes people ask you like, what is big bang testing in interviews? Okay. So make sure you give these ex explanation. This is example. This is a correct example that I have given you that you can talk about. Okay. This is one of the link. I would highly recommend you to guys check it out. Link in the description you can check it out anytime read more about the big bank approach okay thanks a lot this is your host Pramod, and thanks for a lot for watching till now and if you if you have learned something new make sure you share and subscribe to the other people so that other people can get benefit from it all right thanks a lot i'll see you in the next video see you bye